the world, uh, the world economy is recovering, uh, but it is, uh, it is a two-speed uh, recovery. If you look at uh, emerging market countries, uh, they have been going very fast. We expect them to go uh, about as fast next year, not quite. And also they're getting to the point where they're getting back to full potential. So the main issue for them is now overheating uh, rather than anything else. Uh, if you look at advanced countries, then the growth is much slower, much lower. Um, they still have a large output gap uh, which they need to make up. So unemployment is still very high. And our forecast is that next year growth will be roughly the same as this year. Uh, that's not going to be able to make a big dent uh, to unemployment. I see, I see two issues. Uh, the first one uh, is uh, capital flows uh, to emerging market countries. And that's a combination of the fact that the countries are doing well, uh, so their growth prospects are very good, and the fact that interest rates in advanced countries uh, are not so high, they are very low, so there's a strong incentive to, uh, to take your funds to emerging market countries. Uh, now, capital flows are both uh, a blessing uh, and potentially a curse. And they are a blessing because you can borrow cheaper from the rest of the world, which can't be bad, but if they come too fast or in the wrong form, uh, they can be difficult to handle. And so I think the main challenge for the emerging market countries next year is going to be how to avoid overheating, handle these capital flows. Uh, the issue confronting uh, advanced uh, economies is the fiscal one. Uh, the crisis really has created a large fiscal hole, uh, large debt, large deficits, uh, and these have to be uh, slowly eliminated or reduced. That's going to take a long time. Um, and you can't do it too quick, because if you did it quick, too quick, you would kill growth. You can't do it too slow. I think the, the key there is to put in place a medium-term plan, something which uh, over five or ten years gets you there, make it in a credible fashion, and some countries are not there yet. That's going to be their challenge.